If you're doing only one of these revision strategies, you're probably gonna end up with a grade C or lower at A-level biology. But if you do all five of these revision strategies I'm about to go through, you can end up with an A star. Revision strategy number one is watching YouTube videos to help you understand or prepare or get ready for lessons. Revision strategy number two is blurting. So once you've learned a topic, writing down everything you can remember and then filling in in a different color pen what you forgot and repeating that blurt. This is great for improving long-term memory and identifying what you don't know. Number three is using flashcards. Using flashcards is such a good way to improve your long-term memory of theory and key marking points. But you've got to make sure you are testing yourself regularly and you're spending more time on the cards you can't remember as easily. Number four is an essential one. Reviewing any test that you do thoroughly. And by that I mean going through every question and wherever you lost the mark, identify which topic and skill that question was on. You then get an idea of where you're losing the most marks so you can focus your revision on those skills and those topics more to be efficient with your time. And number five is the big one that all A-star students are doing, and that is completing lots of past paper questions. And that is with your notes and without your notes. It's in timed and not in timed conditions and it's going through marking, really strictly following the mark scheme, picking out key marking points each time, and again, reflecting on where you lost the most marks so you can focus on doing more those types of exam questions. So start doing all five of these now to get yourself an A star.